Hello viewers, my name is Khan and I will tell you how to replace the shock absorber of the ND set washing machine. You will hear when a machine go on spin session, it will start making creaky sounds. The reason for this is that the shock absorber are broken. When I roll the drum, there will be no such sounds. Take the machine out of its place. Shut off the water and electric supply. And then we will remove the top of the machine. There are two screw on the back side of the machine. Those hold the top of the machine. We'll unscrew them and then we open the top. Now top is removed and I will check that the suspension springs are in good condition. If they are good condition, then there is no problem. And then we change the shocks. We lie down the machine on the one side to access the shock absorber underneath side of the machine. We lie down on the one side first. So you can see that here is the shock absorber and it's almost gone. I already ordered the new ones from a company and the same model. And we need to remove this shock with the help of a wrench is I think 10 mm wrench you need to use to open this shock. And on the top side of shock, there is a pin. You have to just pull it and it will come out. A new shock required a very strong force to move in and out the shaft. On other hand, the damage shock absorber have no strength at all. Take a new shock absorber, put it on its place, and with the help of a range, we tight this nut on the lower side. On the top side of the shock absorber, we place the pin it be in between the holes. After finishing this or installing the shock absorber, we move back the machine to the top side and then we lie on the other side to change the other side of the shock absorber. This is the other side of the shock absorber. We will remove it and then replace with the new ones. Just push the pin back. It will release from the top side. Push the pin one side and pull it from the other side. It will release the shock absorber from its position. This is the old one, it's almost gone. And you will see the new shock absorber. I need a strong force to pull the shaft out and pull the shaft in. After installing the new shock absorber of the other side of machine completely, we will turn the machine back to the normal position. Then we put the top cover of the machine back on it and fix it. We'll attach the water supply, electric supply, and then we run the machine. 
Here we go. There are no Sukiki signed anymore with this machine. Thank you for watching.